Is it the right time to buy or sell the SPY ETF? In this video, we will delve deep into the SPY ETF. Our initial report was published on our website on Thursday, November 2, 2023. Today, we are here to provide you with an even more detailed analysis. Don't forget to subscribe, hit the like button, and turn on the notification bell to stay updated on our latest analysis. We wouldn't want you to miss any crucial updates that could impact your investments. Improve your trading decisions by trying our recently launched AI stock analysis tool, powered by GPT-4, at stockinvest.us. Tap into the power of artificial intelligence and receive free price predictions and in-depth analysis for any of the 25,000 companies worldwide. Please note that this video is for informational purposes only and should not be considered as financial advice. On November 2, 2023, our system identified SPY as a buy candidate with a score of 2.42. Now, let's delve into the stock's performance during this period. We'll closely monitor this evaluation to see how it unfolds in the upcoming days. In the short term, the ETF is currently experiencing a falling trend. This could present a great opportunity for short-term traders to sell, as we can expect a reaction back towards the lower part of the trend. Keep an eye out for a potential trend shift if the top trend line at $434.22 is broken. Looking ahead, the three-month trend suggests a potential minus 6.36% change over the next three months. This means there is a possibility of a return between minus 11.11% and minus 5.59%. Meanwhile, the 12-month trend indicates a 14.84% change over the next year. This could result in a potential return between 9.77% and 26.44%. In other words, the price range could be between $472.74 and $544.57 after a year. Our latest update for SPY indicates that the SPY ETF has been upgraded from a sell candidate to a buy candidate after Thursday's trading session. On the last trading day, Thursday, November 2, 2023, the SPY ETF price saw a gain of 1.91%, rising from $422.61 to $430.68. This marks the fourth consecutive day of gains. It will be interesting to see if this upward trend continues or if there will be a minor pause in the coming days. Throughout the last trading day, the ETF experienced a fluctuation of 1.02%, ranging from a low of $426.56 to a high of $430.92. The price has been fluctuating during this period, with a 1% gain over the past two weeks. On the last day, the volume decreased by minus 3 million shares, with a total of 91 million shares being bought and sold for approximately $39.28 billion. It's important to note that a decrease in volume on higher prices can indicate divergence and serve as an early warning for potential changes in the next few days. Over the past 52 weeks, the highest price of the ETF was $459.44, while the lowest price was $368.79. Currently, the price is 6.26%, equivalent to $28.76, below the 52-week high, and 10.27%, amounting to $49.30, below the all-time high on January 4, 2022, when the price reached $479.98. Let's take a look at the signals for SPY. The SPY ETF has both short and long-term moving averages indicating a positive forecast for the stock. However, there is a general sell signal due to the relation between the two signals, with the long-term average positioned above the short-term average. In case of downward corrections, there is support expected at $418.27 and $428.24. If the stock breaks below these levels, it will issue sell signals. On Friday, October 27, 2023, a buy signal was issued from a pivot bottom point, resulting in a 4.87% increase so far. This suggests that further rise is indicated until a new top pivot is found. It is worth noting that despite the increase in prices, the volume fell during the last trading day, creating a divergence between volume and price. This could be an early warning sign and requires close monitoring of the ETF. Additionally, some negative signals have also been issued, which may impact the short-term development. 
Furthermore, the three-month moving average convergence divergence, MACD, is currently indicating a sell signal. In the long-term chart, the ETF had a golden star signal on Monday, March 27, 2023. This signal occurs when the short-term moving average, long-term moving average, and price line meet in a special combination. This rare combination is often followed by significant gains for the ETF. Here are some other signals that you might find interesting. The moving average convergence divergence has given a sell signal. Pivots indicate a buy signal 5 days ago. Bollinger bands also show a buy signal 5 days ago. The short-term moving average indicates a buy signal 4 days ago. The long-term moving average has given a buy signal 2 days ago. The relation between the short and long moving averages suggests a buy signal 33 days ago. If we look at the 12-month chart, we can observe the following. The short moving average indicates a buy signal 2 days ago. The long-term moving average shows a sell signal 32 days ago. The relation between the short and long moving averages suggests a buy signal 24 days ago. Don't forget to visit our page at stockinvest.us for more signals. Today, we're going to discuss support, risk, and stop loss for SPY. Let's start with support. SPY has found support from accumulated volume at $429.54. This level presents a potential buying opportunity as we can expect an upwards reaction when the support is being tested. This is an important factor to consider when making investment decisions. Moving on to risk, SPY tends to have very controlled movements. With good liquidity, the risk associated with this stock is considered very low. This means that it is a relatively stable investment option. Now, let's talk about the ETF's recent volatility. In the last day, SPY experienced a price movement of $4.36 between its high and low, which represents a 1.02% change. Over the past week, the ETF has shown an average daily volatility of 1.12%. These figures give us an idea of how much the price can fluctuate and help us assess the potential risks involved. Today, we'll be discussing potential day trading levels for SPY. If SPY is moving upwards, the first resistance level to watch out for is at $431.39. If you're not currently holding any shares, it might be a good idea to wait for the stock to break through this level before considering a position. However, if you're already holding SPY, this could be a level worth considering for swing trading. On the other hand, if SPY is experiencing a downward trend, it will encounter its first support level at $429.54. If this support level holds, it could present a favorable entry point, as there's a potential for a rebound. Our recommended stop loss level is $413.62, which represents a decrease of 3.96%. This particular ETF exhibits low daily movements, resulting in a lower level of risk. Furthermore, there is a buy signal indicated by a pivot bottom that was identified four days ago. Is SPY ETF a good investment? Despite the ETF currently experiencing a downward trend, there are several positive short-term signals. This suggests that there may be a buying opportunity at the current level, with a fair chance for the ETF to perform well in the short term. As a result, we have upgraded our analysis conclusion from a sell to a buy candidate since the last evaluation. Upon analyzing the volatility and movements of the last trading day, our systems have determined that the current price is overvalued. For trading on Friday, November 3rd, we anticipate that SPY will open down by $1.30 and begin trading at $429.39. Before we begin, it's important to remember that trading carries a significant risk of losing money. It's advisable to consult with a financial advisor before making any decisions to buy or sell securities. Please note that StockInvest.us should not be the sole basis for your investment choices. By utilizing this information, you acknowledge and assume responsibility for your own investment decisions. We'd love to hear your thoughts on this stock. Do you agree or disagree with our current view? Share your opinion in the comments below. And what's your target for the ETF? Let us know. Don't forget to like and subscribe to stay updated with our latest content. Wishing you successful trading and a wonderful day from all of us here at Stock Invest.